Hello dear students, this is engineer Akib Ahmed from Department of Civil Engineering UT Bishawar. So in previous video, our tutorial, we constructed the stage construction and uh, also calculation phase. We <coughs> run the calculation phase. Now today we will see how to uh, analyze or how to see the output results of uh, the project so here is the project so the green check mark shows that uh, these are uh, calculation phases are uh, already done so to view the calculation results I would like to click on the view calculation so the output menu or up output window is opening now it is uh, open so this is the deformed mesh so we want to move to the last stage the load application so now we want uh, to measure uh, if you want to measure uh, that how much displacement occurs in the whole project so you can uh, click on the deformation and then total displacement and uh, deformation in z, z direction so here you can see that maximum value is 4.660 in 10 raised to the power minus 3 meter and minimum value is minus 0 0.1060 meter so this is the displacement or settlement of the floor now you can also see the contour and now i uh, you can also see by clicking the view option viewpoint and top view front view right view left view rear view uh, bottom view default view in top view I want to be in the default view so this apply now from this you can also uh, see this and uh, now I wanted to create a section so this is my section so if you want to view the side view so click on the viewpoint and uh, front view apply okay close now this is the front view and these are the contour for deformation displacement now press control and you can see that by pressing control and pressing uh, positive plus at the same time so it will move so now uh, we want to view point the default view apply close so geometry nodes now we want to if you want to view the or analyze the bending moments so you can click on the you want to shift to the load last stage you have to shift to the last stage or you also analyze by excavation and uh, construction and load application so i wanted to calculate all uh, the, at the last stage load application after the load application so click on the deformation or stresses if you want to calculate stresses so these are the stresses now if you wanted to calculate or uh, wanted to see the bending moments so or double click on the floor here in the wall this so I wanted to view this in top view so that I will select top view these are the bending moments 
the distribution of mending moments uh, below the uh, raft so forces i wanted to view the m moments so these are the m11 so in at the intersection of two beams and column here uh, the point load was applied so here the moment is more as compared to other uh, areas in the floor so the maximum value is 1133 kilonewton meter per meter and minimum value is 314 kilonewton meter per meter so this was just the calculation uh, you can also search by uh, finding the uh, you can also click by forces and also view you can view the n1 axial and uh, axial forces shear forces and moments and these 1122 and 12 subscript shows uh, in which uh, direction you wanted to view the moment and shear forces it depends upon the local axis uh, we will discuss in further tutorial about that you can also draw the graphs uh, in further tutorial i will show you how to draw, uh, draw or uh, uh, equisite the graph from the Plaxis 3D output. Thank you. This was uh, for now. This was enough. In further tutorial, we will now uh, we will discuss the pile raft foundation and in further excavation and sand etc. is mentioned in the Plaxis 3D tutorial. Thank you. Like the video and subscribe the channel.